Right, it's now 11.06 a.m. I'm about to leave my flat and we'll see what happens whilst I'm out this time. Chocolate is a pocket. Chocolate is a right. Let's go. So no one's rung the buzzer this morning. No one at all. No deliveries. Not seen any post guy. <sighs> Not seen anyone. Not seen nobody. So Boots have got my mobile phone number so I would imagine they'll text me when it's going to be delivered because you shouldn't leave medication on the floor. <coughs> Should have to sign for it as well, it's my medication. One thing is paramount and that's my safety and security and if no one else will protect me, I'll protect myself. <laughs> I'm not getting into cars that have got broken wing mirrors that aren't fit for the road. Or I think a taxi driver is under the influence of drink or drugs. <laughs> There were several occasions where my mother allowed my father to drive me home, drive me home to Lansdowne Court where I used to live. So she allowed him to drive me home. He had cataracts. He had cataracts. He was taking medication. And on a couple of occasions, he drank some beer, beer, alcohol. <laughs> also on one occasion my dad was driving back from All Hallows Caravan Park where my mum rang the phone whilst my dad was driving she rang his mobile phone whilst he was driving and um He said to me, Ness, can you take the phone? Your mother's ringing whilst I'm driving the car. And he called me Ness because that's my nickname.
This isn't funny, this is serious. It's not funny. That car nearly crashed. Double G on it. That's a woman's breast size. Did you know that, GG? It's a woman's breast size. What's that, Matt? You've got to understand that these people want to make other people think you're crazy because they're breaking the law. They're committing fraud. They're stealing. They're making money out of a vulnerable person. They're thieves. <laughs> and it's not, um, it's not abnormal to think some place is bugged either. Princess Diana... <laughs> Thought Kensington Palace was bugged. <laughs> Princess Diana thought her husband was cheating on her, and he was. And she was labelled nuts. People do that because they're guilty themselves. That's what they do. To cover up what they're doing, they say people are mad. I mean, they're just filthy, disgusting and vile. <laughs> so phone hacking yeah people hacking into phones Gordon Brown said his phone was hacked into the ex-prime minister what's mad about that mad about that saying your phone's been hacked into or you think something's bugged <laughs> it, well with, what is a bug a bug is a listening device that is planted in someone's home so they can snoop or a pervert can watch what you're saying and doing <laughs> Well, there are such things as bugs, and people do do it. So it's not madness. <laughs> it's not mad at all. Not madness. busy today, the sun's out, it's nice. It's nice. I'm going this way. There's people everywhere this morning. <laughs> So we've had someone's loud radio upstairs above me. The guy upstairs is in. His kids aren't up there, but there's a loud radio on. <laughs> but I just put a radio on to cover it up. Oh, by the way, when I was um, coming back from the shop, 
the lady next door with the dash hand was coming down the stairs with that scre it screams. I walked back outside the front of the flat and I let her go out with her big beanie hat on. It's a big floppy beanie hat as well. And I walked back in when she left because that dog is crazy. <laughs> I'm not frightened of it, but I mean, it's just a noise. <laughs> Noisy. Right, there's a woman with a camera. Well, she's got a phone like me and her dog's loose. So her phone's out like mine and her dog's running loose. <laughs> well, as far as I know, some my... YouTube views get about 20 views. 20, which isn't a lot, is it? Average is about 20, 25 views. So what are they worried about? Why would they be panicking? <laughs> Wouldn't worry, would you? Things, the thing is, people know nobody's going to do anything. So, so if, if a dog jumps all over me, no one's going to do anything, you see. So they think they're above the law. They think they can do anything they want. So we've got this woman, right, she's got some kind of long coat on and she's got a dog off the lead and she's... I'm just walking Max. I'm not out here to, to meet people. I just want to walk my dog. That's another tactic they use. Um, pro provocation. Provoking someone, trying to provoke a reaction. You know, I just get it, it get caught on camera and it's proof what they've been doing, so. <laughs> Simple. <laughs> But I don't think it's madness to think something's bugs at all. In this day and age, this internet, you know, what's going on in this world, and especially the bullying of transgender people. The savage bullying that's going on in this world. Our King of England has got cancer. We've got Camilla Parker Bowles virtually in charge. Camilla, because Charles is unwell. Look at the state of this country. Look at the state of Great Britain. It's not our country anymore. <laughs> it's not our country. It's mob rule. Mob rule. It means you've just got you go, you go outside and you've got a. <laughs> there's no police. In other words, there's no police in. The police are rendered useless. They can't do anything to help. So people have to defend themselves. There's a lot of people dying. There's a lot of stabbings and murders, especially in London. It's a dangerous world we live in. 
and I'm protecting myself. And if people think I'm mad and stay away from me, well, that's good. <laughs> that's fine by me. You'll see what happens when people do what they like. You've got shopkeepers scared to do their jobs, teachers scared to teach. <laughs> And if people think I'm mad, they stay away from me and don't touch me. <laughs> so I ain't putting up with none of their bullshit. <laughs> and obviously, some nitwits go down my videos, so some of the 20 people that watch the videos go down the videos just to annoy and be stupid <laughs> well that's more for them isn't it uh, they're idiots <laughs> If the police do not get their act together and we don't get rulers of this country that actually help and support and do something, then this country is fucked. <laughs> because you're getting drivers into vehicles that aren't roadworthy. getting ambulances that don't turn up to fucking elderly people on the floor <laughs> me I, I just don't I don't give a fuck what people think <laughs> I really don't <laughs> they think I'm mad good while well, they continue to thieve, steal, extort and fucking get away with almost murder. <laughs> if they don't want to care about their safety, that's up to them, but I fucking care about mine. See you later guys, keep safe, take care and don't let people push you about.